Oh, come on, ref, are you blind? That was never a foul. These bloody referees ain't got a clue, David. Go on! Run, you stupid lazy! Oh, what was you aiming for? The bloody floodlights, you twat! Hi, guys. Oh, you watching soccer? Yeah. It's not soccer, it's football. Oh, the Americans call it soccer. Oh, was there a lot of Americans where you grew up in Lewisham? Well, no, but... Then it's football, and I would appreciate it if you kept your voices down. I'm trying to watch the game. Okay, no problem. Seriously? You're not going to give a penalty for that? You should be pulling out your red card, not pouncing around like a fairy. Do your job properly or get another job, you bloody stupid clueless no good waste of space. Well, you get really into this, don't you? Yeah, I can't help it. I'm a huge West Ham fan. You seem very on edge. Is this a final? No, it's pre-season friendly. What's in the bag? Oh, it's just my yoga mat. I've just had a lovely two-hour silent yoga session that's brought me inner peace. Yeah, that's super. Look at this striker, ain't it? Worth a toss. You could put a cow in the middle of that penalty box and he'd probably do better than this knobhead. Deep breaths. Inner space. Can you stop mumbling and put the kettle on? Fine, but I think you should come with me next weekend to the yoga weekend getaway. It might release some of that anger and aggression you have inside of you. No, I'm good, thanks. Maybe you should come and watch a West Ham match so you can build up some anger. It's healthy to have a small flip out from time to time. No, not for me. I'm a calm and collective person. Also, thank you for the offer, but I'm not into sports. Yeah, and I'm not into weekends away with a bunch of snobs sitting around in a circle humming Kumbaya. That's not what we do. We spend the weekend cleansing our bodies and our minds. Yeah, well I'm going to spend the weekend drunk and angry. It's the first game of the season. I've got two tickets to watch West Ham slaughter Liverpool. Can I come? I would love to bring you, David, but I don't have enough tickets. Uh, well, you just said you have two tickets. Yeah, I do, but I like to have the extra seat. It's always so cramped in them seats, so I'll buy an extra one for comfort. OK. OK, Mr Daz, I'll tell you what. I will come with you to your West Ham game this weekend. Only if you promise that you'll come with me to the yoga weekend getaway the following weekend. Why would I agree to that? Because I will pay for the getaway. It won't cost you a penny, and it'll be a weekend away. OK, cool. We can do that. Uh, can I come? Oh, I'd love to bring you, David, but I only have enough money for me and Mr. Daz. Okay. Uh, why are we taking the train when we could have drove to the stadium? Because parking is impossible on match days. Besides, at least this way we get to enjoy all of the football atmosphere on the train. But there's nobody on the train, Mr. Des. Wait for it. So, which one is your team? Claret and Blue. Um, which way are they trying to score? That way. And um, what is the score now? We haven't kicked off yet. Oh, okay. It's really nice in here. For the amount of people here, it doesn't seem to be all that loud. Oh, come on, ref. What are you doing? Open your bloody eyes and watch the game and you might make a bloody correct decision. I don't care what anyone says. That was our throwing. How long left? 85 minutes. Well, that's a long time. Don't worry, it flies by. Oh, come on, Arthur. Did you not see him that space down the flank? Yeah, up here. Look, I can see it all. Try running a bit. You get paid enough to do it. Oi, you, get off your phone. You're supposed to be watching the game. It's quite boring. How can you call this boring? Can't you feel the buzz in here? Feed off the atmosphere and let it... Oi! That's a bloody penalty! Off, 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 off! Yeah! What's happening? If you watch the game, you'd bloody know. We just got a penalty and Robertson got sent off. Oh, cool. Come on, you iron! Come on, you iron! Uh, no! What are you doing? That's not how you take a bloody penalty, you moron! You whack it! What was with all the bloody feet, you twat? It seems like this game's going on forever. Shut up, Nick. We're in stoppage time now, so it's nearly over. Good, because I don't think I can take any more of this anger in. <laughs> oh, that was a great game. Uh, what was the score, Mr. Dez? We drew 2-2, but we were so close to winning the game. Uh, who scored the goals? What do you think this is, the bloody 90s? Look on your phone. OK. I must say that I thought I was really going to dislike it at the match, but the fact is, I hated it. How could you be into such brutality? Brutality? Football isn't brutal anymore. You only need a gush of wind and a plough fall to the ground holding his chest as if he'd just been shot. Well, I didn't like it. 
Well, I don't care. In future, you can go to your poncy yoga weekends and leave me in peace with a footy. Except for next weekend, when you'll be coming with me. Yeah, about that. I don't think I can make it next weekend, Nick. I knew you would do this. I tell you what, if you don't come with me, I will start making YouTube videos of me discussing all kinds of different topics. I have so many things to say and the only place that I can do it is in the apartment, so you choose. The next month of me talking non-stop or a weekend away where I'll barely speak. Hmm... Namaste. Namaste. Nick is gay. Nick is gay. Mr. Dad, show a bit of respect. These people are here to find inner peace. Yeah? Well, I'm in a rush to find a toilet, so where is it? I think that hot dog I bought at the station is repeating on me. It's in the hall. Namaste. Namaste. Hi, everybody. It was my choice for today's activity, and I've chosen to have a yoga circle out here in the lovely forest. Please, everybody, sit in a circle. Close your eyes and let's all find our inner peace. Nick. Nick. Where's the nearest restaurant? I need food. Shh. Don't you shush me. You know what I'm like if I don't eat. When this is over. Nick. Nick. What? How long does this go on for? Only three hours. Three hours? You having a bloody laugh? You want me to sit on this floor for three hours to find my inner peace? I don't need my inner peace. You know what I need? A lasagna because I'm bloody hungry. Be quiet, Mr. Daz. Fine. Hmm. Hmm. Hum. Nick. What? I think I just heard a bear. I think we should leave. We're in Epping Forest. There's no bears here. How do you know? Because I bloody do now. Be quiet. Alright, calm down. This was supposed to be a relaxing weekend. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Cypher. Today I decided to break Mr. Fortnite Daz, with... these people pay good money for this, so please don't spoil it for them. You mean they throw good money away for this? Surely you can do this at home with a forest sound effect on YouTube. It's not the same. Listen, if I close my eyes here and I close my eyes at home, I don't see any difference. The only difference is at home I can get up and make a bloody sandwich. You can get something to eat when we're done. Fine. Nick? Nick, it's important. What? Look. Chloe, your hair. <laughs> your hair is on fire. Your hair is on fire. Right, I think we should cancel this session and try again tomorrow if that's okay with all of you. Oh, I was enjoying that. Go home. What? Why? Because I came here to find inner peace and in less than two hours you've made me want to kill you. Just goes to show that these places are a rip-off. Right, I'm off. See you later, losers. Hi, Mr. Daz. Hi, Nick. How was the rest of your weird hippie weekend? Not good. I got banned from the yoga club. Why? What do you mean, why? Because of you, Chloe now looks more like a Charles. The club had to refund all of the money for the three hour sessions you ruined and apparently you broke one of the toilets when you first got there. Oh yeah, sorry, I forgot to mention that. Chloe was pretty cute. I haven't seen her without hair, but I'm sure she still has it. Is she single? I'm going to bed. Okay, but you don't seem very peaceful. Oh, come on you twinkle toed pansy. Stay on your feet and try shooting once in a while. Oh yeah, this is relaxing. <laughs>